If you are hanging out in Kannapolis, you might run into this sweet little girl. This is Millie. She's a therapy dog. Her handler, Lieutenant Justin Smith, is here with us this morning. How you doing, Lieutenant? I'm well. Thank you so much for inviting us. Uh, thank you for coming. We are all already in love with Millie. She is the cutest, sweetest thing. What kind of dog is she? She's a five-month-old Bernie Doodle. Bernie Doodle. So Bernie's Mountain Dog and, and Standard Poodle. Standard Poodle. Yep. Oh my gosh. Okay, tell us how Millie came to be with the Kannapolis Police Department. Well, our administration about a year ago decided to go ahead and start a therapy dog program. Yeah. Um, we, so we developed the policy, uh, had an assessment for the handler, and we were just waiting on our dog. And uh, we had a, a donor uh, a few months ago um, decide to, to donate, donate her to us. I heard she also had a sister. She did. Who went to CMPD. She sure did. Which is sure really did. cool. Tell me about the need for a therapy dog within a police department. Uh, well, like I said, our, our administration is rather progressive and, you know, I've been in law enforcement for a long time mm -hmm. and our each generation took on more and more responsibility and steps toward mental health, but it was still kind of a stigma. Mm -hmm. uh, and so we have taken that step to bring a therapy dog into the department. So she belongs to everybody. I just happen to be the one that has to handle her, but mm -hmm. she belongs to the whole department, just to help them through their day-to-day -day activity. Because, and I think, you know, the big stuff that we see on the news that you all have to deal with right. is what we connect with, oh, that must have been a tough day for law enforcement. Right. But every single day, you guys see things that are tough to deal with. Absolutely, and, and every day, you know, it may be something really bad, it may be something that's just kind of, kind of a little annoying, but they put it in a box, and they put that box on the shelf, mm -hmm. and eventually that shelf uh, it overflows. So. Sometimes having a little dog to pet and love on for a second Absolutely. does help make the day a little bit easier. So now what kind of work do you and Millie have to do together to get Millie ready for her job? So she will go away from me for eight weeks Okay. and I'm, I'm ma slowly making friends with that. Um, <laughs> and so she'll go through a basic obedience training and then therapy dog training. Yes. Uh, and then after that I will come in, they will show me everything that I need to do and then hopefully we can just get right back to work. And so what will her day-to-day -day job be, you think? So her day-to-day -day will be to come with me to work. Mm -hmm. uh, we will just go around the department, uh, just let her socialize, let her interact. If there is a critical incident, um, we'll get called out, we'll come there, we'll just be available. Mm -hmm. um, so she'll be available, I'll be available. Uh, together as a team, uh, we'll work through any critical incidents that we need to work through. But for her day-to-day, -day, she just comes out and she is just there and available to anyone who needs her, the civilian staff, sworn staff, uh, anyone at all. What has this process been like for you? Were you a dog person before Millie? Oh, 100 percent. Yeah. 100 percent. Yep. Um, I I am so thankful that 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 I'm able to to work with her. Um, it I've been in law enforcement 27 years wow, altogether, um, and this is the best job I've ever had. Oh, the best job I've ever had. I love that. Well, she's a, a very sweet girl. She's oh, been yeah. very very lovely so far. It's almost like you feel like she was born to do it. Oh. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. It was it it was just everything just fell into place with her and and we think w we couldn't have hit the lottery better <laughs> oh. <laughs> with anything else. She is such a sweet girl. So might people in the community see her out with you as well? Oh yes, I I take her everywhere I can. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm not going to go if I know I'm going to a call. I'm not going to take her, but if sure. if I'm out and about, I take her anywhere I can, even off duty. Yeah, and I socializing her, her is really important oh, to get her in any kind of situation, right? Uh, absolutely, absolutely. Oh my gosh, we <laughs> are in love with her. I know, girl, you're going to do a good job at your job. Um, I, we should have some information for the Kannapolis Police Department that we can put up on the screen. Of course, we are so grateful to the men and women <laughs> in law enforcement, uh, particularly today in Kannapolis. Thank you all for all of you, all that you do. Give them a follow on Instagram, X, and Facebook. Lieutenant Thanks for bringing uh, Millie to see us. Thank you so much for having us. Millie, show him your good side. Look at Millie. <laughs> there you go. Show him the good side. Look at her hairdo. She's so pretty.